Ladera Ranch. It's family friendly, but is it the right community for you? In today's video, we're gonna take a look at the pros and cons of Ladera Ranch and see if it's a perfect fit for you and your family. So let's get after it right now. Okay, let's start off with the cons. Con number one is affordability. Housing prices all across Southern California are out of control. And here in Ladera Ranch, the prices are quite high as well. Median price for October, 2023 was $1.18 million. And that was for all property types combined. That'd be single family, condo, townhome. If you're looking at single family detached homes, the price was $1.86 million. That's the median price for a single family detached home. So as you can see, prices here in Ladera Ranch are still quite high. Con number two, Ladera Ranch is a very homogenous community. If you like a lot of diversity in the way that your homes look, well, you're not gonna find that here in Ladera Ranch. It's a planned community and all the homes pretty much look the same. So if you're looking for a lot of diversity, like I said, you're not gonna find it here. But it is a master plan community and there are a lot of positives to that. Saturday night, you get in touch with all your friends. Hey, let's go do something. And what do you get back in return? Yeah, there's not a lot of nightlife here in Ladera Ranch. Yes, there are a lot of restaurants, a lot of things to do, but as far as if you want the club scene, you don't have a lot of that here. So if you want that, you're gonna to have to go to a neighboring city. There are a couple places that you can go that do have some entertainment from time to time. For example, you can go to the Ranch Sports Bar and Grill where they have uh, you can catch baseball games, football games, UFC fights with your family and friends. And then you could also go to Joe's Italian Restaurant and they have uh, somebody there usually playing live music. So there are a few places that you can go here in Ladera Ranch. But overall, there is not a lot of nightlife. Con number four is HOA rules. Being a master plan community, there's a lot of things to keep up. You have parks, you have pools, you have green belts, all those sorts of things. So there is an HOA here. If you wanna paint your house pink with a purple door, well then Ladera Ranch may not be the place for you. Con number five is freeway accessibility. You're not super close to the freeway here. It takes you probably 15 to 20 minutes to get to the freeway. It's not too far and the drive is not so bad, but if you're one of those people who like to be able to just hop on the freeway right away, you're not gonna get that here. Con number six is public transportation. There is no public transportation here in Ladera Ranch, so if you're looking to catch a bus or a train, you're not gonna get that here, and Ladera Ranch may not be the place for you. You definitely need your car here in Ladera Ranch. So those are my top cons for living here in Ladera Ranch, California. If this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you can be the first to learn about the current market here in Ladera Ranch and South Orange County. My name is Troy Gregory. I'm a broker associate with Starfire Real Estate, and I get calls, emails, and texts from people just like you all the time looking to make that move here to Ladera Ranch. So if you're thinking about moving here real soon or maybe 90 days in the future, give me a call, send me a text, drop me an email. I'd love to help you out. Now we've got to all the cons here in Ladera Ranch. Ladera Ranch is not all doom and gloom. There are a lot of positives about living here. So let's get to the pros. Pro number one are the amenities. There are a lot of amenities here in Ladera Ranch. You have parks, pools, trails, green belts, all sorts of things that you can get out with the family and enjoy a day out. A big spot is Cox Sports Park. I spent many years at Cox with my son doing baseball with the Little League here in Ladera Ranch, and it's a great time. There is also the water park here in Ladera Ranch. It's a great place to go to spend the day out in the sun, get yourself wet, get the bucket and dump some water on you. It's a fun time for the whole family. Pro number two is the family-friendly environment. There's all kinds of events going on here in Ladera Ranch. Every summer they have a concert series. This year it was highlighted by 70s tribute band Yachty by Nature, and that is a great time for the whole family. Other things that are going on, you have the 4th of July events, which is you have a 5K and a 10K and a concert, 
fireworks at the end of the night, plus at Thanksgiving time, there's a turkey trot, so there's all kinds of things for the family here in Ladera Ranch. Pro number three, Ladera Ranch is known for its top rated schools. We have three elementary schools, one middle school here in Ladera Ranch directly. We have Oso Grande, Chaparral, and Ladera Ranch Elementary, and then Ladera Ranch Middle School. They're all A-rated schools, and they're in the Capistrano Unified School District, which is an A-plus rated school district. As far as high schools are concerned, there's two high schools that most of the kids go to. You have Tesoro High School and San Juan Hills High School. Both of those schools are also rated A+. Pro number four is safety. If you're looking for a safe community, Ladera Ranch is a great place for you. You can have a complete peace of mind knowing that here you're going to be completely safe. Pro number five, access to nature. There are a lot of trails here in Ladera Ranch that you can go walk in. Right now, I'm sitting on one of those trails. You can see it's absolutely beautiful. There's also a lot of parks here. So there's a lot of things that you can do outside and you have a lot of access to nature. Whether you're biking or walking, it's a good time for the whole family. So there you have it. That's my pros and cons for living in Ladera Ranch here in South Orange County. If you're thinking about moving in the next nine days or 90 days, give me a call, send me a text, drop me an email. I'd love to help you make that smooth move here to Ladera Ranch and South Orange County. And if this is your first time to the channel, please like, subscribe, and click that notification bell so you can be the first to learn about the current market here in Ladera Ranch. So until next time, I'll see you around town.